we want the three of you to tell a scary story. A very scary story. I think your body is turning into little pieces. I'll have the evidence and act like everything's fine. I think your body is turning into little pieces. I'll have the evidence and act like everything's fine. Wow, what a spooky tale. Anyway, welcome to a brand new month here on Nimrod Horror TV. And uh, this month is Storytellers. I uh, decided to take off last month and just do this one this month. So, so beginning Storytellers, let's go to a relatively new film. One of last year's most talked about horror films. Um, let's go to VHS. Now, this isn't like like a storytelling as in someone just sitting down and telling stories. This is, um, basic story is this, this, this group of like, I guess you could say trouble, troublemakers, um, get this job where they, where they're gonna get, you know, it's like money as long as they break into this guy's house and they steal a, 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 a VHS tape. The problem is the guy's house that they break into has a lot of VHS tapes and, and they didn't really tell them you know which VHS tape to find. They just said you know you gotta bring bring this one VHS tape and when you find it you're gonna know. Um, the whole film is kind of like it's 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 basically found found footage style. Even even like the main kind of kind of story, you know, like how there's always like little stories, but there's like one giant story, you know. Um, uh, so like we first introduce to like the group, and they're all kind of like kind of guess guess you kind of say rebel kids you know they do like petty theft they make uh, they make their money like going around the town and like uh picking up girls shirts and and selling that to people i uh, just you know stuff like that nothing too violent that they do um but still pretty bad i'm not promoting that um so anyway, so so they break into this guy's house. There's lots of VHSs. Um, they find out that, that the guy is is uh, dead in his chair. So they just kind of start, hey, let's let's put in a VHS and see what it is. And that's how how this uh, movie runs. Is they they put in VHSs and uh, in between each mini movie. Or, or a VHS VHS story, you know they 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 go they go around the house and one by one they are slowly killed off. And I'm not going to spoil too much because you know that's 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 that's, that's a big story. Um, but into the actual mini mini movies, um, there are some really good ones here. Um, I will say. The the first one is um it's kind of a kind of like a demon vampire tale, and that one's really good. It is really gory. Uh, it's just fantastically done, and I like it too because it's it's it's, it's not just like you know video camera. It's like this guy has like little spy spy glasses on. And you kind of just, and they're, it's basically frat boys trying to get laid, and uh, they run into this lady who's not exactly uh, normal, and it's great. There's, there's an OK Woods one. Actually, it's a little bit kind of lameish, 
But, you know, it's short, so... So you don't get too bored into it. You're just like, oh, this is, you know, it's typical. With these kind of movies, one story is probably going to be kind of lameish, and one's going to be good. Um, and then... Then the other two, two VHSs, if memory serves me right, it's four total story. Uh, two are just okay on the good side of, of uh, entertainment. Um, I don't want to dive into each story crazy because that's going to take too much time. Uh, but that, that's basically, you know, uh, so this is a bad review. There's, there's a sequel coming out, which I hope that they kind of, like, make it kind of a sequel to one of the stories. That would be great. Um, yeah, this, this is a really good anthology film. It's, and it's one of the best found found footage films ever. It's it's really surprising. I had heard so much talk about it before watching it. And I and I was just greeting it that okay, here's a movie that's just overhyped that you know so many overhyped horror films don't turn out to be that good. This one actually turned out to be pretty good. It, and then I was over talking it to people. I was like, you have to watch VHS. It's so good. Um, it's it's really well directed, especially for like these kind of films. The gore's really good on the films with gore, the ones that don't, whatever. Um, so I definitely recommend this movie to really any horror fan, even the fans who don't like found found footage films, because I'm not a huge fan fan of that uh, subgenre, but but this one almost changes your mind. It's so good. Um, with that, I want to wrap it up here on the first storytellers. And I will give this a remarkable 8 out of 10 storytellers. See you guys next time.